bully teams are the end? Well, again, we make it uh, hard on ourselves, Doug. You know, um, every team is coming in and giving us the best shot. We're learning to be the hunted instead of the hunter. Uh, it's a different mindset. Uh, you're going to get the best shots, and you've got to give, be focused, and uh, mental mistakes can't happen. I understand back-to-back -back travel, getting late, but, again, all those are excuses. But uh, I thought our guys battled in the second half. We made, made ourselves uh, – made winning plays down the stretch uh, to get ourselves back in. And we're going to see that uh, from here on out into the playoffs and throughout the playoffs. Hey, about Brandon takes those two three-pointers, one went over the basket, the other was the air ball. No compunction about taking the next one. Confidence. Uh, that's the one thing the young man has. He's, he has supreme confidence in his shooting and himself. Uh, we have supreme confidence in him as a player. Uh, and, again, it's uh, everybody rolls changes just a little bit when you have Cal out. And have to step up another level, and I thought he did. Can you talk about the decision to rest Kyle and how to handle it? He did a great job. He did a great job. You know, again, um, we're not in, you know, guys a little worn down back to back. We got another big week coming up, so we got to be strategic in how we rest players. Um, got a little nicks and bumps and bruises, and so trying to keep everybody fresh. You put Jonas back in the game in overtime. Catch balls. That's it. That's it. And make free throws. And that's one thing he's very good at, uh, especially in the situation where they switch a guard on him. He can just reach up and go get it. Again, those in the game situations are great for us. Uh, I haven't seen a perfect one yet, you know, to go exactly the way, but I think our guys um, did a good job of being physical, coming, meeting the ball. And again, at the end, it's a free throw game, and uh, JV did a good job with that. <clears throat> sort of like anchoring the defense there at the end, directing traffic and really stepped up with that block? Well, again, you know, they, they're they so athletic and so fast that that, that was the difference. Uh, and he, he did a good job. He's switching off on Powell and also with Nerlens Noel <laughs> in that situation. So, again, just thought the mobility, the speed and quickness of him, uh, his shooting. I thought we needed offense a little bit to space the floor a little bit to get uh, Noel out of the paint, and I thought he did a good job with it. Is your happiness of the outcome tempered by what got you there? Uh, again, I, I'm never completely happy because I see the big picture, but I, I like the fight. I like the, the way the guys come together. The same thing last night. I thought they had grit. I like to use the word grit because I think that's what makes you win, helps you win in the NBA. Uh, and our guys have shown that. And, uh, and it's a habit. And we're building that habit, building those scars from mistakes. Um, Again, you know, we're, we've got to have supreme focus to be successful. And we didn't have it in the first quarter. And some of it, got new guys in the lineup, different lineup, different rhythm. Uh, OG just coming back after being out two and a half weeks. So there's a lot of different factors there, variables that go into that. And, um, but I like the way the guys bounce back. That comes from I mean, is a lot of it you as well. Do you take on your I don't know. That's the only way I know how to be. I think that's the only way we can be. I said it all the time. We don't have Michael, uh, Larry, Kareem. You know, they're not walking through that door. So we got to play hard. We got to compete every possession. We got to be the hardest working team on the floor every night. And if we don't, uh, we're, you know, we're, we're a good team, but we're, we want to be better.